Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Gears of War 2. Here we are, Wednesday at 11, just turned, just immediately, like, as soon as I said, it hit 11. So, here we are, Wednesday, 11 a.m., May the 4th, 2016. Where are your children? Anyway, the, uh, <laughs> well, if you're a teenager, shut up! <laughs> the, like, the, uh... Some crap went down yesterday, ladies and gentlemen. I had to go to the dentist's office, and then I had to go back to the store after I finished, like, finished my job. After I got through at the dentist, and I got back into Decatur at 5 o'clock. And I, I had to stay at the store at least for another hour. Like, and so, 6 o'clock, I thought, dude, there's no way. There's no way I'm going to be able to record... And do that at the same time. So check this out, ladies and gentlemen. To use my forward thinking here that I just acquired last week. Um, I actually have to do the same thing I did yesterday tomorrow. I have to go with my grandparents to Chattanooga to go to another doctor appointment. I'm going to the eye doctor this time. Do you like my teeth? I went to see the, the dental hygienist. Hopefully she made them look pretty. If she didn't, I, well, she was pretty. So surely she could she could have forced some attractiveness onto the, the teeth. Yes, she was gorgeous. But anyway... She has a fiance. What is that about? Who was a fiance? Can someone tell me what a fiance? The um, I have to go see the eye doctor, but I have to do the exact same thing. I have to have a flashback repeat of yesterday tomorrow. So I'm not gonna be able to record tomorrow. So you know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. We get to do eight episodes today on a Wednesday in the middle of the friggin' week. We get to do eight episodes. So this is the plan. We're gonna do eight episodes today. Upload them all day tomorrow. And then we'll record Friday and Saturday. Hopefully Saturday with Philip, but we're definitely going to be into Gears 3 by Saturday. There's no doubt in my mind that Gears 3 is probably going to be going down. Holy God. Oh, did you see that? I shot you in the freaking face. Definitely, dude. Are you excited? Like, we're almost done with this game. We have five chapters left. We're on the last act, and we just started the first chapter of the last act. Is that not the most exciting? We got to keep our sniper rifle, but we, did, we didn't have this pistol last time. Contact. Ooh! Is that another Carmine? Carmine's got shot in the freaking face. <laughs> it's like, because the fish monster doesn't make any freaking sense. Wait, where's the sniper? Where's the sniper? I don't know where the sniper is. I'm a little nervous to call. I don't know where the sniperello is. Mr. Sniper. Mr. Sniper, Mr. SpongeBob Sniping Pants. Anyway, it's been interesting, ladies and gentlemen. Some stuff did go down yesterday after the dentist's office, which was it was both cool, but at the same time very eye-opening. Um, first of all, before I even start with the crap I'm going to talk about today, um, I would like to, oh god, I would like to, oh god, yes, I would, oh, oh god, my life. Oh, uh. I would like to give a big shout out and a humongous, the biggest thank you that has ever been given to anybody that gives away musical uh, VSTs for free. I'd like to give a big thank you to them, but I'd like to give an especially big thank you to Vox Ango for giving uh, old school verb a uh, stereo widener, which I, I desperately, desperately needed. They, uh, and they, they had another, they had a, a tube amp, they had a tube amp saturation thing, and I downloaded that stuff. I sucked what I needed right up, and I, I said, I need to, I need to tell them thank you on the next video. Vox Ango, ladies and gentlemen, V-O-X-E-N-G-O, -E Vox Ango. I don't know if it's .com, just type in Vox Ango, you know, on Google, you know, the people I work for, and it will, um, and it will take you, hopefully, to their website where you can... If you're into music production and that's, like, what you do... Dude, they got some sick stuff. Or I hope it's... Like, I haven't used it yet, but I imagine it's got to have more color than the default stuff that comes with Studio One. It's got to have more color than that. And that's really what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. It's just diversifying the color of my sound. And, I, dude, I, I took what I needed. But I desperately needed that stereo widener, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my God. You have no idea how much I needed that. And now I've got one. Now I've gotten a stereo widener. That's exciting. That is probably one of the most important things I've downloaded in the last couple of days. What do you mean, Sam? You've downloaded more? Yes, I actually... Like, I don't know how I subscribe to these people, but apparently they found my email address. And, uh, there's this, uh, little company called Waves, and, uh, they make a lot of, uh, 
VST uh, plug-in stuff, and uh, they model them after other things. Like, I don't know if they're the company that actually models it, or they just make the, the programs, or they just transfer. I don't know. But Waves, it's, it actually really is a pretty huge company, and that's what they do. They do VST plug-in stuff. And they sent me this, like, one-day deal thing on their website that they had. And they had something that I've actually mentioned in, in a couple of videos before. I mentioned that I desperately needed a tape saturation plug-in. And sure enough, the first thing on that, that uh, deal that they had was a Kramer uh, tape saturation machine. And I thought, oh my god, I've got to get it. It was $100. It was discounted like... 70%. It's normally like 150 bucks. Oh, it's a gear. Never mind. <laughs> I thought that was a bad guy. Discounted like a, to 100 bucks from like 150, 160 dollars. I'm like, dude. And like, I, I had, I never like make an account and just spend money for no reason. Like, but I did that today or yesterday. I, ha I had to have that tape, tape saturation machine, but they had the way they had the deal set up. The more you bought, the more you got a discount on. So I thought, okay, well, let's see if we can find any like any little things that would just help with the overall sound. And I found like a reverb uh, plug-in that was it just it was called Wetter, and it was just like a really easy way. Like it didn't really have a lot of uh, let's see how to how to explain. It didn't really have a lot of uh, okay, this sucks. Um, didn't really have a lot of. Uh, I don't know how to explain it. it wasn't a complex machine. You know, it, it was one knob where it just was a quick fix for reverb. And I thought, well, it was only like 20 bucks. I thought, yeah, I'll, I'll snatch it up. I don't care. And so I picked that up, and then I picked up a, um... Oh God, there was something else I picked up. It was, uh, that stereo widener. Oh, no, it was a stereo widener. Oh, like, oh, my God. The, 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 the tape saturation was big, something the wetter. And then I got something for... Oh, I got a de -esser. Yeah, yeah, they had a really cheap DSer on there, and I thought, oh, I might as well pick it up. And I, you know, because those those little things that just, just help your overall sound, you know. So I, I ended up spending like 150 bucks. Just, just I had no anticipation anticipation of, of spending that money. But dude, when I found those things, I thought, mm, and I almost, just about, just about, like I may actually go back later and pick this up. They have this thing called Guitar Solo, and what it is, it has a the plug-in. That, you plug your guitar straight into your mixer or your computer or whatever you have going for you. You plug it straight into that, and then you open the plug-in, and then you choose what amp you want. You choose what kind of stomp boxes you want. And I thought, I thought, you know, that would be a lot easier. It may have, oh, crap, this part. Oh, jeez. Oh, this sucks. I can't tell you how many times I failed this. Failed this part on, on, uh, <laughs> insane, ladies and gentlemen. This might be the hardest part in the entire game on insane. I'm just, I'm just saying, it it just might be. Because you've got to take out all these Reavers that are flying around, but they're they're constantly blowing up your, your stuff, man. They're blowing up your comms array. Yeah, why don't you talk about the game, Sam? That'd be a good idea, talk about the game. Crap, I don't know. I don't know about the... Oh, I got one. All right. Who else? Who else wants something? Who else wants something? Oh, didn't think so. Actually, they just keep making circles, ladies and gentlemen, so you might as well just shoot them. Just shoot everything. Shoot everything, ladies and gentlemen. Kill them all, dude. There we go. Three more Reavers. Three more. Three more. There's one. That's right. You land. As long as you have one satellite still up, you'll be all right. Ah, come, on. come on. Come on. There you go. One more. One more. Come on, girl. Come on. I guess your saving grace in this is the fact that the Reavers just keep making rounds and, like, the same ones. Like, they don't regenerate their health. They just... Oh, there you are. There you are. They just keep uh, coming back and eventually enough time and enough bullets will kill them. Whew. We saved. We saved one, I think. Yeah, we saved one, but we still saved. We still won. Who cares? So, I'm probably going to go back and pick up that guitar. The thing is, dude, I don't know what kind of, uh, I don't want it to sound too cheesy, ladies and gentlemen. Like, the sound I've got coming out right now is from the guitar cabinet into a microphone. You know, I don't want it to turn it into something that does not sound organic, that doesn't breathe the way the speaker does. And the problem is... It's not coming out of a speaker, Sam. It's not going to emulate it precisely the way it is now. But I'm thinking maybe it would emulate it better. So what I may do, ladies and gentlemen, when I... I guess we are the support. Oh, referencing the first gears. Oh, man. I think we finally just uh, made our peace with Hoffman. I don't know. 
Because he, he told us that in the, in the first Gears. He's like, or he told Kim. He's like, are you kidding me? You are the support, son. I just wasted all those bullets. Good job, Sam. All right. Um, you got a mortar here, ladies and gentlemen. You want to save that uh, a thing. And there is a secret. Oh, oh, never mind. There we go. That's what I'm looking at. I'm looking at you. You're looking at me. But I've also decided, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to um, go ahead and upload all in the name of rock and roll. You know that cover I did that I didn't think turned out so well? I was listening to it the other, or just earlier, and I thought the other day, yeah, today. I was listening, and I thought, you know, it's not that bad. I mean, it's it's nowhere near the production quality of Girls, Girls, Girls and the way that album sounded. But um, at the same time, there's no way I would be able to replicate that entire album. So I'm just going to do the best I can with what I got. And that pretty much ultimately came to the decision of, well, yeah, you might as well just release it, Sam. I mean, it's not bad. The guitars didn't turn out as well as I wanted to. I don't know if it was a mic placement problem. I think it was an EQ problem. It really kind of flattened out the sound, unfortunately. But um, but it's still, it's still really gainy guitars. It does, they don't sound terribly bad. Oh, it's a sniper rifle. Snipper riffle up in here. Ooh, go ahead. Dude, I missed Philip, man. Oh, speaking of that, ladies and gentlemen, his... Uh, uh oh, you heard that, right? You heard that. His, pa his grandparents got in a car accident. Um, they're okay, but they are a little beat up. Uh, he said like his um, they both have concussions, and his his grandmother's got uh, a broken rib, and his, his papa or his grandpa has a uh, a broken arm. So if you would please keep them in your thoughts and prayers, I know you. Cats don't even know him, but I mean, he's my friend, and I'd appreciate uh, the thoughts and maybe the nice comments if you'd be so kind. But, uh, ladies and gentlemen, you want to take this mortar and you want to kill these friggin' broom ox, ladies and gentlemen. They, uh, they will mess you up if you are not careful. But, uh, unfortunately, it looks like we might be too much for them. We might just be too much for the broom. You gotta open your mouth, don't you, Sam? You have to say you're better, and then they just shoot like 10,000 missiles right in your face. Yeah. This is the way it goes. That's how it's happened uh, every single freaking time I've done it. Maybe we got a checkpoint at the broom ox. No, oh, I guess not. Okay. Come on. Come on, you freaking grubs. I've just about had it with all your shenanigans. Oh, is that no oh man. I guess my advice to you, ladies, I'm gonna stand as close to that front wall barrier thing that you, as you can. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, God, I'm happy to be back here. We're probably gonna finish this game today because I was thinking about it. We would get, we're gonna get close with the, um, or we're gonna get pretty close with four episodes. I think we'll definitely get it with uh, eight. So. We're going to bust out eight of them right now. If we finish the game, great. If we don't, then I guess we'll finish it tomorrow. We'll be at the very end. I know that. Dude, we, I don't know. if We might see 10,000. I don't know. <laughs> wow, 10 years and only 10% of this achievement done? Yeah, well, it was it was a rough 10 years. You know, it wasn't the easiest 10 years of my life. Uh, is there any more grinders? Do we have more grinders? It wasn't matter. I think there's a secret down here, ladies and gentlemen. One of my collectibles that I missed was, I think, right there. Cog tags or something. But we're actually, oh man, we're coming up on that. I didn't think about that. That last, we're, we're going to get achievement in this round of recording, ladies and gentlemen. That's exciting. That doesn't happen every day. I wish it would happen every day. Whenever I get my Xbox One, it pretty much will happen every day. Oh man, that's be exciting. But that's 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 going to be a lot later, ladies and gentlemen. I don't, I don't even know when. Like that's that's four hundred dollars I'm going to have to pay that I haven't even worked into my budget yet. You know. All right, ladies and gentlemen, just stand as close as you freaking can to this. And hopefully they'll miss you every time. Hopefully we've got our fingers crossed for. Oh, I see that broomock over there. I don't see him. But I'm gonna kill this guy as soon as I freaking can. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. He's gotta. He's gotta come straight out. So we might as well just shoot that right now. Ooh, ooh, good shot. Good shot, Sam. Got him. I hit him too. Dude, good timing on that. Oh, I missed. I think I missed. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, you didn't even get to shoot one missile. You didn't even get to shoot one. Oh, who just reached another level of enlightenment? Sam did. Suck it, mother lover. God. Dude, and we got to keep our sniper rifle, too. And that that's the first one right there. We did the first one in 15 minutes. How about that? So what's our status? We have a plan, but Foobar. it's not going to be easy. 
We've identified an underground cavern near the Locust Sinkhole. Really? We believe that a strategically placed light mass bomb can give Jacinto its final push. Really? What's the catch? Due to Cedar and Nemesis infestation, we're unable to get a chopper down there God. to deliver the bomb. We need someone to clear the target area. Mm. And by someone, you mean us. Exactly. Baird, Cole. Dude, Marcus, I think you like being the center of attention, dude. Bombs. Only. <laughs> God, not again. Um, anybody that wears uh, toboggans, or not toboggans, but uh, what are those called that starts with a B? I don't even know. I don't even know what they're called. What's up, man? How you doing? Oh, what the? That was a, that was a headshot, dude. Come on. Oh, now that was a headshot. Now that was, ladies and you want to take out these snipers first. Don't, don't be stupid like me. Don't be stupid. Take out the snipers. Take out the snipers first, ladies and gentlemen. It's just a nightmare and a half. Trying to kill all this. No, I don't want to split up. Splitting up never turns out well for me. It always turns out well for you, Dom, because you can't die. Except for that one time. You're out. What are you talking about? Oh, good job, Dom. Got him out in the open, but I still can't kill them. Oh, is that are those wretches? Did I just see wretches? I didn't see, tell me I did. I didn't just see wretches, did I? Wretches is not what I just saw. I, I don't tell matches. I don't think I can handle wretches at this at this juncture in my life. I don't think I can handle them. You know, I've got, I'm not getting any younger, and I know that guy's not dead. He can't be dead. Ah, there he was. Oh, he's dead now. Oh no, he's not. No, he's not. Oh, he's dead now. I promise. Pinky spurs on that. Was that Dom? Let's tell me that's Dom. Oh, no, of course. Why? Why would I think? Why would I think that was Dom? Why would I think? I can end the video. Ladies and thank you for watching. Welcome to the second chapter in the Gears of War. God dang it! Somebody. Stop playing reverse whack-a-mole with me. I'm getting sick and tired. Um, I got the boxes. Find the boxes. What boxes? We're actually coming up on that last collectible, ladies and gentlemen. How exciting is that? That's the most exciting thing I've seen all day. Finally, after 10 years, going to get all these achievements. Well, not 10 years. But... Rap. Rap. All these flaming boomers. Oh, God. There's not two of them, are there? Well, of course there is. Of course there's two of them. Oh come on! Shoot! 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 Just die! Just die! If I can hit the if you can hit the the tank, ladies and gentlemen, that's it, that's even better. Well, kind of better. Kill this thing, Dom! Stop laughing! Fire is not funny. Is that it? Is that everybody? I mean, I need some ammo after all this crap. Where's this guy? Who where who is Dom shooting at? You guys see anybody? Oh, oh, oh yeah, I see somebody. I can't hit anybody though. Oh crap! Great, great, fantastic. We haven't chainsawed anybody in a long time. <laughs> Be uh, really nice to do that again. If I do say so myself. <laughs> oh, I didn't work. Dang it, he just hit him. That's no fun. I tell you, it ain't no fun waiting around to be a millionaire, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, thank you for watching. Keep it real. Keep doing you. I got to tell you another story that's actually pretty dang important in the next episode. Uh, this just happened yesterday. Wow, a lot of crap happened yesterday. I will see you in... I can't remember if we go left or if we go right. Uh... Uh, I think we go left. I think. I think. Split up. So either way, you gotta end up in the same old place. Either way, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah, I remember now. Okay, yeah, we'll do this next. But thanks for watching. Keep it real. See you in the next episode. Peace.